right welcome back students from my side a small surprise for you all so i try i felt uh, for you all electricity chapters very very difficult so i tried to give you a small input that is very 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 important for solving the circuit suppose in your je exam basically uh, you have you have very less time to solve isn't it so suppose in the exam if they give you to find the current passing through a 6 ohm resistor like circuit is given to you you need to find that particular thing so solving a circuit within a time is very difficult so i'll give you a short trick which can be solved in 2 minutes so what is that suppose for the given circuit you need to find uh, the uh, current flowing to this that is the through 6 ohm resistor how should you do this can be done using a theorem called thevenin's theorem let us write that thevenin's theorem okay according to thevenin's theorem the formula is i is equal to v o c divided by r equivalent r e q plus r so what is v uh, v o c stands for v o c stands for open circuit voltage this particular thing r e q or this then this stands for equivalent resistance then r stands for resistance where the current is passed to the uh, particular uh, thing like power to the uh, circuit right so the given circuit now let's see fine so to find step one let us go step by step now to find voc the first thing voc means voltage across resistance now this is the part which you need to find isn't it you need to find i so this is what you need you need to find now what is voc voc means voltage across r3 click now when r3 is removed right this is what is the open circuit voc as a name suggests oc means open circuit voltage right so voc stands for again it means a voltage across r3 when r3 is removed that is vab vab now what should you do therefore now what will happen when you open the circuit here this particular point voc becomes uh, voltage across r2 isn't it yes because you you open the circuit then what happens there is no current which is flowing through r4 and r5 right so now r uh, v uh, voc as i said this particular thing becomes uh, uh, this particular voltage voc becomes equal to r2 now what am i trying to explain according to this voc is equal to vab because there is no current flowing through this this got completely disconnected so voc is equal to vab vab so the formula is for this vab is equal to v into r2 by r1 plus r2 okay v into r2 by because this has become equal to this r2 by r1 plus r2 that now i need to find after voc i need to find the next one that is r equivalent to find r equivalent just see now what are you going to do to find r equivalent short circuit the voltage right when you short circuit the voltage source and measure the resistance from a to b right then this becomes r equivalent when you short circuit the whole thing this will become uh, you can measure the voltage resistance from a to b isn't it that is called r equivalent to find the r equivalent the formula is okay therefore the formula is r equivalent is equal to r1 r2 by r1 plus r2 plus r4 r5 by r4 plus r5 right uh, right so now what happened to this we have opened uh, we have sh uh, short circuited this this becomes parallel okay this one this particular thing then this is series this plus and this be again becomes parallel right right so this is the formula now let us apply this using the values now this formula is ready this formula is also ready let us start so according to this formula when i have to do let us come back to the circuit which is given to us we have done the open circuit here isn't it now apply this so according to this voc is equal to how much is this v voltage given is 12 into how much is r2 2 divided by how much is uh, r1 given to us r1 plus uh, r2 that is 3 when you solve this you get 8 volts okay let us come back and solve r equivalent according to this formula according to this formula r equivalent is equal to okay r1 r2 i am substituting r equivalent is equal to 1 into 2 by 3 plus r4 r5 2 into 4 by 6 when i solve this r equivalent i get an answer of 2 ohms that's done yes now let's come back and solve the final one i need to find the current according to thevenin's theorem isn't it what is that formula voc i got already r equivalent i've already got 
resistance yes so according to this voc the value which i got is 8 divided by r equivalent which i got is 2 ohms plus 6 right when i solve this i equal to the current which flows so that is 1 ampere this is how so the, the easiest way and the most important way to find uh, the uh, this is current passing through 6 ohm resistor hope this particular video is will be useful for your je mains exam very very important video you will